those pets that are more likely to be affected are going to be those that go to daycare and dog parks frequently. Tonight, a mysterious respiratory illness. It's popping up in pups, and it could be deadly. Cases have been reported across the country and right here in Illinois. But experts are left puzzled as they still haven't been able to pinpoint the cause. Casey Cronus in the West Loop tonight with the latest. This illness is also coming at an inconvenient time, with many pet parents already planning to board their dogs this Thanksgiving. Now, veterinarians say you might want to think twice. Just days before the turkey hits the table, your travel plans are likely set. But if you're sending your furry friend off to doggy daycare, experts warn that a nasty sickness could leave your pet in a rough situation. What sets it apart is that it's not responding to our normal treatment for um, respiratory tract infections in our canine patients. And then also that it's more commonly progressing to pneumonia. Symptoms include nasal discharge, cough, tiredness, decreased appetite, and fever. Really, as soon as you see the signs, you're much more likely to have a quicker and more successful recovery. The longer it goes on, the harder it is to treat and will require then hospitalization. Dr. Jordan Beecham, the medical director at Good Vets in the West Loop, tells us she's seen more than a dozen cases of the mystery illness in the last two weeks alone. It spreads through nose to nose contact and potentially even sharing water bowls. Until the illness is contained, she says limiting exposure to other dogs will help keep your pup healthy for the holiday. Just like with people, minimizing contact. Um, so if you can, not taking them to boarding and grooming facilities, daycare, um, and dog parks. While your dog's standard vaccines might not prevent them from getting sick, Dr. Beecham says that those shots are important in protecting them from secondary illnesses. In the West Loop, Casey Cronus, Fox 32, Chicago.